It's Miss Hemi, back again. Uh, I got something in the mail today. I think it's one of my, from the look of it, one of my long-awaited magazines. I can hear my sister now in my head going, You need to write that down before you touch it. Where did it come from? It came from... <laughs> I can't say it's South Korea. I am getting better, though. Who knows? Perhaps if it was written in Hangul, <laughs> I could understand what it says. I'm finally getting the hang of that. Finally. Still a couple of letters, um, but for the most part, okay. Throw that over there. Oh, yes. Tiger. Otherwise known as somebody I really don't want to see. Uh... Mm, you're cute. And you're in Prada. Did you know Louis Vuitton made um, earbuds? <laughs> Weird, to say the very least. Thought I was going to need the scissors, but it turns out I didn't. Who knows how long that's been sitting? Not me. Mm, wine. Old Town Road. More Tiger. Ah, I remember now. Way in the back. All right, I'm going to try to hold this so you can see it. You're not going to be able to see me, which kind of bothers me. But it's our boy, John Gan. And it says, before sunrise, before sunset. Whew. Gonna look tasty. See? Looks like a pillow, but it's Gucci. So <laughs> I've pretty much learned <laughs> it's Gucci. If they tell him to carry it, he'll go, okay. There is that pumpkin. Hi, little baby. Hi, Nini. Hi, Nini Bear. So cute. <laughs> oh, Lord. 
There it is. Got his foot on the table listening to some tunes. Looks good. Looking delicious, our Nini. Help me, Rhonda. <clears throat> of them have a kind of soft quality to them. And that was the last one. Hmm. Should have been more than that. Hello, love. But if memory serves me correctly, um, <laughs> and I'm sure it does, there is a magazine coming where he's in this same coat. The difference is he's on the cover of the magazine. Um, why did I put that a little skin in? <clears throat> hmm. Now this is the March, April, May, two months ago issue and I'm sure I ordered it no I actually ordered this one in March but March I think I ordered it the 10th of March it's been over a month Anyway, here's the mag. I wanted you all to see it because I thought our Nini looked. When I saw the pictures, I said, oh, our Nini looks so cute. I want to see him, our Nini bear. Come I think this one's my favorite. This one. I think he looks. Oh. <laughs> hmm. Tasty. He looks tasty. Well, another book to add to my collection of books, magazines with pictures of Jongen. <laughs> I'm going to have to have a shelf for them soon. Because I know I have a magazine coming that he's on the cover. I also have a magazine that Chanyol is um, on the cover. <laughs> You know, I've already gotten my magazines with Baekhyun on the cover. Baekhyun. Baekhyun. Yon. Yanni. Baekhyun. Anyway. I just wanted to share this with you. Um, you all tend to like my unboxings and my um, un enveloping. <laughs> It was an envelope and it it looks like it's been sitting a while you're right um, the less than you gouged out of me for it what guess what buddy found somewhere cheaper than you to get my magazines now. <laughs> and I plan to take advantage of it. I hope you all enjoyed that. Um, I didn't even tell you what magazine it was. Yeah, that was GQ Korea. 
So I have GQ Korea. I have copies of Vogue Korea, W Korea, L Korea. Oops. Sorry about that. Um, <laughs> all these book magazines from Korea to someone who can't read Korean. I can pick through. I can say the words. Takes me a minute, but I can say the words. But I have no idea what they mean. I have been trying to learn on my own at home, and I have just come to the conclusion that I'm going to have to bite the old bullet and pay for a class and go somewhere once or twice a week doesn't appeal to me because the only place that I found that seemed reputable um, is like over an hour away <laughs> from where I live and still my god we're going back to the age of giant afros pretty soon if I don't get to a barber shop or buy a pair of clippers and <laughs> I'm afraid if I buy a pair of clippers I really won't be able to post any videos for a while but this is this has gotten way out of hand anyway if you enjoyed seeing our Nini please be sure to give the video a thumbs up if you're interested in <laughs> Zooming with me and teaching me Korean, leave a comment. Uh, <laughs> if you know someone else who enjoys looking at pictures of Jongin, you might want to share the video. And if you are so inclined, feel free to subscribe. It would make me terribly happy. Uh, <laughs> but no pressure. I'm just a little old lady. Anyway, <laughs> and I've said that several times. Anyway, this is Miss Hammy. Have a wonderful weekend. If you're in the States, have a great weekend. Um, if you're in South Korea, it's still the weekend. and <laughs> You're just a little bit ahead of us as far as time. Um, so, let's see. Anything else? Hmm. Like, comment, share, subscribe. No, that, that about rounds it up. Um, so take care. And hopefully um, this reaction that I have, I will get up for you soon. Um, so take care. And make sure that you follow the precautions set out by the governing body where you live. If they say, stay your behind in the house, Stay your behind in the house. If they say social distancing, then stay six feet away from people. If they say wear a mask, wear a mask. I saw something. This woman had a sign uh, that said, My body, my choice, no mask. Uh, my advice to you is check. Wait a minute. The thing is, the mask is not supposed to be protecting you. It's supposed to be protecting people from you. So, it might be your choice. But if you don't wear a mask, it could be me that gets sick. Or somebody that you care about that gets sick. See, I realize from my age and the fact that I've had surgery this year, uh, in the earlier part of the year, I'm in one of those groups where catching stuff like what's going around is more likely for me than it is for other people. So I make sure, and if somebody doesn't like the fact that I'm standing six feet away from somebody, I had somebody get an attitude with me. You don't want me close to you? No, I don't. And you shouldn't want me close to you. You don't know who I've been around. 
nobody actually because I've been in the house for what seems like forever <laughs> but I'm dealing with it you know so everybody else ought to be able to now I've gone on a rant I'm sorry let's see any other rants I want to go on before <laughs> um oh I had planned to do this and forgot all about it, so I'm going to do it now. Because most of you have probably clicked off the video anyway. Uh, I'm not going to go into what my first name is or what it looks like or anything like that. What I will say is that people have been mispronouncing it since I started school many, 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 many. Let's just say decades ago. Uh, and it's sort of a trigger for me. I don't, when I taught school, one of the first things I asked the kids in my class the first day was, how do you pronounce your name correctly? A person's name is something very personal. Um, Someone took the time to decide that's what they wanted to call you. Your parents picked that for you. Uh, when people mispronounce my name, I am quite fast on the, uh, that's not how you say my name. I'm sorry. And I correct them. If my saying something about someone's name being mispronounced it's because I don't think anybody wants to be called something that isn't their name I don't care if it's well fans do it out of love <laughs> Fans can't take the time to learn how to say something correctly out of love. You know, do not come at me about that. If I say something about names being mispronounced, like I know, and I'm I'm trying to correct myself. I know that Y E O L is not pronounced Yol. Because I've heard Korean people say it, and that's not how they say it. So I'm trying to learn the correct pronunciation. So when I say Chani's name, I say it correctly. That's how much of a deal it is for me. So getting off my little soapbox about, you know, don't crap all over somebody's name because it's difficult for you to say. It's not an excuse. Uh, if you can hear intricate harmonies, you can listen to somebody say it correctly and say it correctly. I don't give a flying flip about Oh, they say it with love. <laughs> really? Give me a break. Anyway, once again, like, comment, share, subscribe. This is Miss Hammy saying bye-bye. Hope you enjoyed seeing my new magazine.